All right there, YouTube people. So I did a thing. Uh, I've got the panels, got the batteries in. We're doing the testing on the batteries still. But the inverter that I had, uh, well, let's say that it uh, suffered a terrible accident of human error. And I hooked it up backwards and I let all of the smoke out of it. That is not going to work anymore. Luckily, it wasn't that nice of an inverter to start with. Honestly, it was never going to work for what we need it for. Um, so I think the, the point of ordering this particular inverter was to cover my office. Um, I have been borrowing one from the Peterbilt. I'm going to put that back up. Um, and so what I decided to do was, was kind of take a look around, understand from some of my peers that have maybe done similar things. Hey, hey what are you ordering? What's working? What's not working? Um, I have had only mixed success with vendors on Alibaba. So I decided to take a look at something, um, that may be made in Chinese, uh, made in China. Uh, but maybe designed here in the U.S. So I've been looking at a few things. There were some really nice ones out there. Unfortunately, just not on the budget list for me. They're in a neighborhood of six, seven thousand dollars. And so for me right now to be able to run uh, the office on solar, yeah, no way, no way. So the other thing too is this may be a, a bit of a gateway product into powering our home. Um, so while while we look at our build and wait for our build to be completed. I'm also looking into that. I want to make sure that this inverter is something that can be big enough to where I may want to put it in a string to have multiple units power one home, right? So some of the feedback I got was on different companies out there. And, and you know, I, I think there are a lot of good options, right? And, and feel free to pop into the comments and ask, you know, hey, Ryan, what did you hear about this? Or, or what does this look like? I've only tried a limited number of them, but I'll, I'll certainly offer up any information I have. But one, as you see on the screen, is Genetry Solar. And I, I hope that I'm saying that correctly. I was able to get in, uh, talk to the owner. Now, full disclosure, no discounts were given. Uh, I'm ordering this for myself. I got good references on it. I certainly did not ask for one. I did let the gentleman know that, that I would probably be reviewing it uh, on YouTube. So, so far I ordered it last week. Um, I enjoyed the conversation with him. He sounded like a very straightforward guy, uh, had a lot of good things to say, and I can tell that he's deep in this. And so I really love to support somebody, especially somebody local. I think the guy's based out of Michigan. Uh, I, I think that's great, right? So I'm very much looking forward to it. Uh, the unit is on its way to me. I don't think I'll get it until next week, uh, but I have received the UPS tracking number, which is pretty awesome, right? So this thing, let's jump over to the inverter. So I'll show you guys which one it is. Oh, the internet's terrible today. Maybe I won't be showing you. Here it is, okay. So I ordered the 6,000 watt inverter. And I think if I remember reading this correctly, you can string up to three all right, maybe, maybe, you know, correct me if I'm wrong there. Um, so the daisy chain connect with multiple features. So it doesn't even say on here. Maybe, maybe he told me it was three, but I, for some reason, I think it was three the, the total. Uh, but for me, if I like this one, I'm going to order a few more and we'll put those on the house. Uh, but you get to pick, you know, hey, what voltage do you want to be supplied by shore coming in? And for me, it's generator down here, and it's an inverter generator. It's only going to put out 120, so that's what I ordered. Um, but the cool part is you, you can tell uh, Sean, hey, this is this is what I want to have in there. Uh, it also does have a port to be able to start your generator. So most inverter generators have their own built-in electric starter. So you can wire those things up. Uh, one of the big things for me was to be able to look at this over Wi-Fi. Now, I don't know that this is a cloud base. This will be something I'll find out when I get it. Either way, I hate the old inverter I have. I had to Bluetooth to it, get close to it, to be able to figure this out. So really didn't like that. Um, let's see what else. Well, either way, I, I just wanted to say that I'm, I'm pumped about getting it. I will be absolutely honest if there are things I don't like about this inverter. Uh, I'm not going to hold back, right? I don't have to be ugly. 
Uh, but on the same note, you know, whatever I can give Sean that will help him improve the product, I want to do that. Uh, but if there's a problem or some reason that you guys shouldn't order it, I'll tell you. Um, but at any rate, wanted to announce to everybody what we have going on. Uh, and this is it. So in a couple of days, we'll release another video whenever this comes in, I guess next week. Uh, we'll release another video kind of letting you guys know how is it performing uh, and we'll do a load test on it for sure because I think I can yeah I can definitely pull 6,000 watts so this thing says it can do up to 12,000 surge and I guess we'll find out on that as well so we haven't received this inverter yet uh, we certainly haven't tested it we're not endorsing it at this point uh, but I really enjoyed the conversation that I had with Sean over at Genetry Solar. So if your viewing of this video uh, takes you to his site, and I think you guys should check him out. Uh, again, we'll definitely release what we think about it once we get it. Uh, but let Sean know that I sent you over there. Uh, I think we'll both appreciate that. And uh, yeah, hope you guys tune in on the next one. Thanks.